Yeah. Wing it. It's everybody's vibration. <laughs> Good morning! Today is November 1st, 2015 and right now it's 8.30 a.m. We're up and early, getting everything ready for the people coming in. We're super excited. I think we got here about an hour ago, and right now the crew is setting up right now. We have all the best people, all the most talented people here. Um, can't wait to start, but right now we're enjoying setting it up for everybody. Thank you. Uh, my name's John. I'm, I'm uh, the, the signer putter upper. Uh, I'm, we are in charge of putting up the signs, the signs and uh, the signs make them look pretty like this. Uh, I gotta say we did a pretty amazing job here. It looks nice and straight and taut. <laughs> You've been up since four in the morning trying to yeah. get the sign up here. Yeah, oh yeah, we've been uh, just up here since uh, sun up. <laughs> Getting the John tree set up. Yeah, you know, I know. It's, it's not easy. <laughs> Someone's got to do it though. Yeah. Plan this stuff out, man. <laughs> Hi, good morning. My name is Sophie Cohen. I'm the assistant for the co-founder from Yoga for a Cause. What I've been doing, what I'm doing now is just being of support for anything that needs to be done, prepping, setting up, helping people decide what needs to be done, and just being complete anchor of love and support and light for everyone at this event. So thank you for, for joining us in this powerful movement and we send you much love. I'm here for the event, uh, Yoga for a Cause is a wonderful event. Um, I'm here to do the photography for the event. It's an honor to be part of this, um, to do something that's so harmonious, uh, so uniting, and um, hopefully I can capture some really great moment for people, and um, people can really enjoy it for themselves, enjoy the moment, and hopefully the photos will reflect that. Thank you. <laughs> oh my goodness. But we're starting at 10, right? Uh, people start coming at 10, but the main event starts at 11. Oh. I love these oh, like, okay. little art things. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. So my name is Jonathan. Everyone calls me Mason though. It's kind of like my alter ego. Uh, what we're creating here today, um, first thing in the morning, we got up, you know, we're going to create heaven on earth. We're going to create peace. We're going to create absolute love. And Yoga for a Cause is how we're going to do that here. In sunny Fontana. So the cool thing is, is uh, we got together with our leadership group and people we love, and we're going to create this event. And all morning we've just been literally just pouring a lot of heart, a lot of love into the situation. So uh, you know, no matter who shows up, they're going to get the best of what we got. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a great night. It's going to be a great day, and we're going to have a lot of fun. So namaste. <laughs> also, have a good one, guys. We'll hey guys, I'm uh, Eric. I'm a videographer for Yoga for a Cause right here on this beautiful Sunday morning. Creating some magic. We're all going to gather together and do some yoga. So we'll be walking around with the camera, talking to people, kind of uh, feel out their vibes, and uh, kind of get an overall perspective of what the energy is going to be like today. We're going to have a lot of good talks. I'm hoping to capture a lot of really amazing footage with our wonderful team of photographers and videographers. So we're going to make it a really, really special day today. Hi, I'm Megan Rodriguez, and I'm here with Yoga for a Cause representing the St. Baldrick's Foundation. And the St. Baldrick's Foundation is a volunteer-driven charity that is funding the best research um, for childhood cancer and is also um, working to give survivors long and healthy lives. I'm so happy to be here and be a part of Yoga for a Cause, and I'm so happy that we can create this amazing fundraiser together. Every three minutes, a child is diagnosed with cancer, and we're funding the life-saving research that can help these children. And you guys are helping us today, too. So I just want to say thank you so much for your support on behalf of the foundation, on behalf of the children, and on behalf of you for showing up to create a difference in this world. So thanks so much. I hope you enjoy the fundraiser. Bye.
Just think about why we're here today. Why are, we, why are you here today? <clears throat> today is only the beginning. The beginning of yoga for a cause. And what is yoga for a cause? It is a vision. It is a vision. It is the vision that we get to co-create together. Because, you know, a couple months ago, we walked around and we asked people, what is the world that you want to live in? And people sometimes say, no, there's nothing I can do about this. You know, I'm just here paying my bills. You know, I'm trying to get a house. But there's also a lot of people who says, I want to live with people in love, in unity, in respect, in harmony. And those are the possibilities. We can create that together. And this is what we're doing now. So who's first time to yoga in the in the space today? Raise your hand high. Yeah. It's gonna be fun. You guys enjoy it. Hmm? I found myself. Not only did I find myself, but I found the magic that really does exist in this world because I opened up the door for the blank canvas for the universe to bring in my alignment, my magic, my calling. And people started just turning up into my life. Situations started just turning up into my life. And I was just like, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is because I've honored really a bigger thing than myself and relinquish the fear of what if. How I see it is that I am driving, say, from here all the way to Florida, but I am driving in the dark and I only have my headlights on. And my headlights only show me 10 feet in front of me. But that's all I need to know because my GPS says I'm on my way to there. I'm on my way to the destination that I want to get to. I just can't see it because that's not how our brains are set up to see the future. We just have to have faith that the 10 feet in front of us is going to lead us to our destination. And I really, really put into practice my faith. And I, and I didn't just sit at home and sit on my sofa and watch TV. I threw out my TV set, I bought a guitar, and I just created. I got everyone involved with my creations and I just created and created. And it came to me that, and most, most of you that's in Discovery know this, but the only moment that exists is now.
a few months ago, I never thought this would happen. Um, I took my first yoga class two years ago. It was a lighting in a bottle. Mm -hmm. I did it with two, three hundred people. I don't know how many. Under the sun too, scorching sun. And I remember I had to hold a pose for 15 minutes. And when the instructor said, we're going to hold this pose for 15 minutes, I was like, no way I'm going to hold this pose for 15 minutes. <laughs> but I did it. And it's not because I did it myself, because there was 200 other people there doing it with me. That's why it was possible. And this event was just a thought three months ago. I had an opportunity to make some goals for myself. And this was the first one that came into my head. Without a second thought, I was like, I want to have a yoga and meditation and get the people together. So we raise awareness and we support the cause. Just like that. And of course, of course, fears came in, doubt came in. Like, Are you serious? Like, how are you going to do this? You don't even know anything about this. You've never done any of that before. But with the support that I have in so class, with the support that I have, every step of the way, every step of the way, it's coming, it, it's here. You guys, we are all the manifestation of my dream of once it was just a thought, when it was just a nice idea. Mm -hmm. And this is the first time in my life where, when, when a nice idea actually came alive. And not just for me, but you know, it was so solid. Really, everybody here doing the first time speech and Eric is still filming a documentary for this event. His first time in Kill away to see this documentary. <laughs> and Laura, every single one of you has made this possible. I want to acknowledge everybody, especially Sophie, mm. who helped me so much. I wouldn't have done this without you. <laughs> 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 Thank you.